during evolution, humans developed certain characteristics that gave them a better chance of survival. Multicellular organisms need ways for their cells to communicate, and there's a number of different means by which the body achieves this. There are some misconceptions with human evolution. Humans did not evolve from apes such as gorillas and chimps. Instead, humans and apes shared a common ancestor that lived millions of years ago. This common ancestor diverged over time to form many different species of hominid, only one of which survived to become modern humans. All the rest of the hominids including early humans became extinct. It's taken scientists a long time to try and discover how humans evolved. Scientists do this by producing an explanation and then looking for the data to support their theory or prediction. Sometimes the data agrees with and supports the prediction. This increases the scientist's confidence that the prediction is correct. Humans are still evolving. Meet Graham. He is a realistic sculpture and believed to be the only person on Earth designed to withstand a car collision. Commissioned last year by the Transport Accident Commission in Victoria, Australia, Graham was made by Melbourne artist Patricia Piccinini. This was in collaboration with leading trauma surgeon Christian Kenfield and crash investigation expert Dr. David Logan. John Calafor from the Victoria Transport Accident Commission told The Guardian, Cars have evolved a lot faster than humans, and Graham helps us understand why we need to improve every aspect of our road system to protect ourselves from our own mistakes. Graham is made from a combination of silicon fiberglass, concrete, human hair and steel. This lifelike sculpture weighs in at around 200 kilograms. Graham's physique shows what humans may look like if we evolve to survive these crashes. Although not the best looking, Graham's head is filled with extra fluid and ligaments. This allows for extra protection of the brain. Also, there is no need to worry about neck injury as he doesn't have one. Since his unveiling, Graham has been on a roadshow around the state of Victoria. The reaction to Graham has been extremely positive, both in Victoria and all over the world. Samantha Cockfield, a director of road safety, said the following. There were 31 million video views, 80,000 shares online, 1.9 million website views within the first few hours of launch, and Graham was the number one trending topic on Twitter, Facebook and Reddit. So what do you think of this design? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.